how to project future results using a trend and gross Excel functions. Let's look at this sales data and look at the graph and we can try first from the built-in function on the graph. Right click on the graph and select add trend line. Here you get a new dialog box and you can select any option. Of course, you should know the mathematical meaning to do this. It needs a little bit of statistics. You can extrapolate and forecast the line. For instance, if we uh, add six points here, add six points here so in the forward direction we could get uh, this we can take the other options also but if you want the real numbers to have this trend and grows we should find another way to solve this there are two Excel fantastic functions. Let's delete the line and close the tab also. First, to measure the trend, highlight the cell ahead of time in column C. And we will enter the trend function. First, highlight it. All the cell and is equal to is equal to trend and select all this uh, reference from P2 to the last cell and since this is an array formula we can simply press enter we should control plus shift and enter similarly let's do the cross highlight column and eight of time and enter the gross formula is equal to gross and uh, gross select all the cells down to the last and press control shift enter that's it we'll see the curly brace for the array function now get both the lines and the data for the trend and gross function now let's uh, yeah, extend the dates to six more times now let's change this to pure numbers to do so copy it first and paste as values only values only this is pure numbers with this one, highlight it, let's right click, drag and fill some six more cells and choose linear trend. Let's do for the cross also in similar fashion, highlight first, drag with holding the right mouse and we'll choose cross at this time. That's it we make a projection from our sales result by using the trend and cross function let us highlight select all the sales now and uh, click it there's a trend and the cross are under so see the graph for both the uh, trend and uh, grows so these this two great statistical array functions will help us to project any data